Should you drop a friend who you're pretty positive doesn't care about you at all? So they've got to be in it for some reason. You do something for them. You run errands for them. You, in some way, help them with their lives. Or, I don't know, you're the cool person they want to hang out with. I don't know. But whatever it is, you know why you're there. And you know why you're a friend, although you know you're really not. So do you want to drop them? Yes and no, because if you completely cut them out of your life, and you may end up having to anyway, but at first I would try not to, because then you're going to get a lot of pushback and they're going to be like, but why? And they're going to try to drag you back into their lives because they need you for some reason. And then it's going to be this back and forth and you'll feel bad and they'll try to make you feel bad and all that. So I would slowly push them out of your life to the point where they don't even know what happened. So all of a sudden they're an acquaintance. And by doing this, you preserve the other friends in your circle, which is probably why <laughs> friends with you too, because you're in the same social circle. I would baby steps here. I would always be busy, which you are. I would cultivate other friendships. I would have less time for them. And yet yeah, they're gonna know you're, that you're pushing them out. But you could be like, I'm busy, I'm busy. So it's not drama, it's not this big heated exchange, but you're like, you're busy. And yeah, they're gonna realize you're too busy for them, which is the truth. You are, you could be organizing your sock drawer and you're too busy for them. Now, if things get really toxic and you're like, I have to completely cut them out, then you have to. But I would turn, or at least try, to turn the friendship into uh, an acquaintance type situation so that when you do run into them, which you will because you're in the same social circle and it's not like so weird and so awkward. I don't know. I, it's, it's a tough situation and you know your place. You know, you're like nothing to them, but they need you for something. And that makes you feel like a doormat and you don't under any circumstances want to be that.